What's up? Are you trying to get your music video reacted to on this channel? All you gotta do is hit up the email down low in the description and book your reaction now. Just shoot me an email, wait for a response, and if I feel like you'll benefit from the reaction, we'll get you all squared away. But now, on to today's highlighted artist. Bad Karma 87. Now this is from Bad Karma's EP that is coming up or has already dropped at this point. Uh, from Devil's Child, and this is produced by H3 Music, who also made the beat for my most popular single ever, I'm Not Okay. So, got some good production behind this. Let's see what my man's working with. We've only got 36 likes, 26 subscribers. If you guys like this song, please, at the end of this video, go download to the description. Show some love to the OG video, because that's what this is about. But here we go. Let's see what my man Bad Karma's working with with 87. Bye. We're gonna be in our fields on this one. I've been having shit bubble up inside my chest. Past trauma, something that I can't digest. Multitude of issues, cut throat coming from my neck. Fuck, there it is, here we go again. Can't let them go, cause if I do, I do I write about. If I did, then you know my music would stop coming out. I would disappear. Damn, see that is, oh dude, I haven't heard anybody talk about this yet. And I've been thinking about this for so long. And he just said it immediately. He's like, if I cut all these vices that I'm working with, if I do all this stuff, then what am I going to write about? Well, like, I can't write about the sad shit anymore. I can't write about the stuff that's giving me motivation to write this music. And I think about that all the fucking time. Like, that, that's weird. That, that kind of gave me a weird little goosebump feeling right there. Again, can't let them go, because if I do, what do I write about? If I did, then you know my music would stop coming out. I would disappear, back karma nowhere to be found. So with that in mind, do I really want to get better now? Nah, I'm not my fucking soul to this shit. Keep at it and just hope it don't get old really quick. I got too much on the line, gotta go. I won't quit until I made it where I want to be, and everybody knows a kid. Outcast is birth, that's how it is. I know I don't fit in. I go against the current, and I tell myself I won't give in. Some days I jump in and decide that it's too cold to swim, but in the long run, I'll be fine. Yeah, I know I win. People come and go, always leaving me with memories of who they were what they like anything they share with me they all stick in my mind to be honest it's embarrassing but people are my problem in a way they're also therapy to everyone i've met i got something i need to prove showing out all the time i hope they don't think i'm rude i know i'm kind of ignorant trust me tell me something new let me in on your thoughts yeah tell me about you i just want to get to a place where i feel accepted all right so i'm liking the vibe of the song and i'm loving the message behind the song because it's super relatable for me specifically i will say some of the flows are a little the head of the beat some of them are right on point I, it's just like almost like you're super excited to like be making the song and rapping that you just get a little bit ahead of yourself so try to tone it back just a little bit stay on that beat as best as you can to make it sound just a little more polished a little more smooth but the mix sounds fine uh, and again, I, I'm really digging the message behind this. I just want to get to a place where I feel accepted. Live out the rest of my life and hope I don't regret it. Be proud of who I've become and the places I'm heading. I spread my name on public places and pretend that I'm a legend. Left my mark on the world in a way that's kind of reckless. Deep in my heart, I'm just thankful that I managed to make connections. Sitting in the dark and finding friends when I least expect it. Shit gets kind of hard, but with them, yeah, I think I get it. Yeah, everybody's got some things to fuck us up and drag us down. Used to be depressed, still am. Guess what happens now? The baggage that we carry is what separates us from the crowd. Burn the crosses, burn the churches, bitch. I'm the pastor now. I just sit in the chaos and laugh with a crazy smile. Talk to myself in the sound, so it's lost for a while losing my grip on my patience and said he's starting to spiral sorry for the way that i yeah. came off i know that I'm so like right there is a big example of where it like there's just too many words thrown in there and it's not even like it's too many words it's just like you're you're saying it too fast where you could fit all the words in just fine on beat but like you're just like blah, 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 like it's just a little jubblish I'm on. losing my grip on my patience and said he's starting to spiral sorry for the way that i came off i know that i'm acting wild i know you don't gotta tell me you don't gotta help me i know that i'm broken sick in the head and unhealthy this is the hand i was mm. dealt i hope that i played it well will i go to heaven or hell it's kind of hard to tell i hear myself in my music and it sounds so vibrant but during my downtime fuck i'm damn near lifeless friends suggest the meds i don't want to try it i need to keep my problems so i can keep on grinding yeah love that man i gotta keep my problems so i can keep on grinding dude that is a very intro introspective song for real like that is just I love that he's talked about this because you don't hear anybody talk about like keeping their vices. You hear a lot of people talking about, you know, trying to lose their vices and move on to something else and get rid of the problems in their life. But my dude's like, nah, I got to keep those because I got to keep writing these hits. I got to keep making songs about depression, about fake bitch ex-girlfriends. I got to keep making these songs. I can't make myself happy because then all that stuff goes away. You feel what I'm saying? And I, I relate to that a lot, a lot. So that's, that's dope that my man has even talked about this. So shout out to my guy, Bad Karma. Uh, hopefully you take some of that constructive criticism like that, but I love the writing, and uh, I feel like you have a lot of potential moving forward with your stuff, especially writing conceptual like this. This is a really cool concept. Just, you know, get that flow down, man. Make sure you get that flow down. Kind of got like a little blue face thing going on there where you're either a little ahead or a little behind. Most of the time, you were pretty ahead of the beat and just kind of, you know, tone it back just a little bit. That's that's my, my suggestion. But 
Uh, yeah, shout out to my guy, Bad Karma. I'm going to drop a like on this because of the writing on this specifically. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to see what else you do, my man. So shout out to Bad Karma. Link in the description below as well as the pinned comment if you guys liked the video. And that's it for me on this one. Till next time, it's been your boy Crypton. I'm signing out. See you guys. Bye. Yeah, I'm out here trying to get it. Trying to get it. Hey. Each and every day. I don't care about nothing in my way. Yeah, I'm out here trying to get it. Trying to get it. Hey. Each and every day. I'm making no matter what they say. Yeah.